Well, folks, as I said last time, I did one of these little, uh, you know, beverage tasting or JM tries videos. Um, gonna try to, you know, add a few gimmicks and, you know, impersonations and impressions and that kind of thing. Uh, you know, and the one I was hinting at uh, last time was kind of a, you know, gamer poop sort of thing where they were. You know, where it was making fun of the uh, Mass Effect games. Um, and as it turns out, um, this is also going to be kind of a tribute to uh, Nash's RDA uh, game stream finishing up Mass Effect uh, Andromeda. Uh, you know, after which I'm sure quite a lot of us could use a drink or two or three. Because, you know, even though it looked like uh, you know, uh, or the Andromeda, uh, you know, had some uh, uh, potential. It really didn't, uh, you know, quite get lived up to. Um, to which all I can say is, well, dang, okay. So as as you can see, I've got actually two, uh, you know, interesting looking, uh, you know, red flavors here. Uh, you know, they had. Several others, uh, you know, actually on the shelf in the hardware store, uh, you know, and I should have been smart enough to buy them, but wasn't. Um, there was like uh, root beer uh, and cola, but uh, by the time I, uh, you know, figured I'd, you know, go ahead and actually get on with it, um, you know, they were either way up high on the shelves or sold out, uh, you know, and given the uh, selection of, uh, you know, interesting uh, labels like uh, uh, Dang here or you know, a couple others that I, uh, well, I'm going to say I can't quite remember off the top of my head, I'm uh, suspecting that uh, quite a few people are going to uh, get these as uh, stop it, stocking stuffers this year, uh, and probably do every year. Uh, I'm gonna suggest, um, you know, letting them chill out in the uh, fridge for a few days, which uh, is actually kind of a standard procedure for me. But uh, just looking at the top here, um, I'm thinking that these are, you know, the kind you need a, a bottle opener for. But, uh, well, maybe not. Maybe they are twist off. Uh, kind of had me fool there. But uh, this this first one I uh, cracked open here is the uh, red cream soda. Uh, long time viewers might remember I uh, tried a blue version of this by, uh, I think the brand name was uh, Frosty, which was... You know, actually, actually kind of what I remember from when I was a kid. So, uh, we'll give this uh, red variety here a try. Um, not getting a lot of fizz in the bottle here. But, uh, we'll see how it looks in the, in the glass here. As, as always, it uh, does look better in the, in the, uh, in the glass. So, um... So here's the uh, writer and his, uh, unfortunately, one game in the Mass Effect series. Uh, well, dang, okay. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. It's, um, uh, you know, it's, it's cream soda, only this time it's red instead of blue like a it was in the uh, other video I uh, did about this stuff. Now, uh, the downside to, uh, you know, bottles like this is that, uh, you know, one, uh, you know, once you get the uh, lid off, you kind of have to commit, which is, uh, you know, to uh, finishing the whole, uh, you know, damn bottle, which is, um, well, not exactly a smart thing for a guy in my condition to do, but, uh, I'm, since I 
showed them both, and I'm trying the second one again here. Um, I guess this is the uh, Italian uh, cherry soda. Um, I did a store brand of something like this uh, back when I first started the series, uh, or uh, this um, you know, J.M. Dry's series. But, uh, you know, I, uh, you know, it was a lemon kind of uh, Italian style soda. But, uh, yeah, I, I'm looking at these, uh, you know, to see if I, I mean, the last one was a twist off, so I'm thinking this one's going to be, uh, this one's going to be two. Um, but just in case I'm mistaken about that, I do have my, uh, Handy dandy uh, multi multi tool uh, bottle opener here that I do have available just in case I need to use it. So um, yeah, uh, there. twist off. But uh, well, yeah, I and mean, again, there's not an awful lot of fizz in the bottle, but I'm sure it will be once I get it into the glass here. Because that's kind of how it seems to work. But, yeah. Um, but, anyway, uh, we did Pathfinder Writer and the uh, Crew of the Tempest with the other one. So, I, I guess here's the Commander Shepard and the Crew of the Normandy this time. Uh, well, dang, okay. Well, that's a good cherry soda. Uh, you know, decent amount of fizz to it. I, I'd say if you're going for a for a cherry soda, uh, you know, this is definitely something you should try and find. Um, now, I, I found this in the same hardware store I uh, found all the frost top stuff I did. But, um, you know, it might be, like I was saying, for a lot of this stuff, uh, it might be available in other uh, other places depending on your uh, market. So uh, it might be helpful to uh, look around and see what's where. So um, anyway, here's the... Uh, I definitely say I'd uh, recommend both of these flavors. Um, I, I think I like the uh, frosty blue cream soda better than I like the uh, uh, dang red stuff here. But, uh, you know, it's still definitely worth a look if you can um, find it. So, uh, anyway, here's the more gaming, uh, you know, more screwing around for me, and, uh, you know, as always, more beverages to taste. So until next time, uh, well, dang, okay? <laughs>